Um, hello everyone. So for today, uh, we will be installing Docker for our machine. And to do that, and to do that, just open your browser and Google Docker. So again, I'm using an uh, Mac OS Monterey with uh, M1 chip. So click lang natin yung nasa home. Or yung first na makita nyo link. And then just click on the download. So get started. So download uh, for Mac. So this is uh, app all chip. So since we are using M1, so let's use the Apple chip. If you are still using the Intel version of Mac, you can download this one. So just click this one and this will pop up. Just click allow for you to download the installer. So while downloading, uh, Docker is like a platform where you in create environment for your uh, for deploying your project. So, for example, uh, if you need a PHP 8 in your uh, application, so you don't need to install the PHP 8 actually. So the Docker, you can run the PHP 8 inside the Docker. So yun yung um, use niya. And it's very uh, so for production, it's very uh, easy to use since um, and with that, it is very practical, no? Especially if you're going to deploy projects in different machines, no? Hindi mo na kailangan mag-install ng mga requirements per PC. You just install the Docker and then siya na bahala dun sa mga requirements. So, this uh, gives you an easy way no, to be independent from the dependency na kailangan dun sa environment ninyo. Ayan. So, I'll be installing Docker since gagamit ako ng Laravel sale, which is a new version of Laravel. So, you don't need to install Composure, etc. You just need a Docker and then you can already run the Laravel sale later on. So, here we will just be installing the Docker. So this may take some time depending on the speed of your internet. So once the installer is uh, finished downloading, just go to your downloads folder and just double click the installer. Then drag this one, the application. Then, as you can see, it will be start uh, copying the Docker files to our application. So, once the Docker is uh, installed, you can uh, see it in our launchpad here is the docker so if you want to start it just click on it and uh, first you need to allow the components uh, for it to be run successfully. Then you'll see here that uh, Docker desktop is starting, and it will show you that uh, it when if it is already running, it will show you here. So yun yung ginagawa ng Docker no. Isa siyang container where in each application you do can have a different environment. So, Docker is now running and you can already start um, doing your uh, environment here. So, that's all for this video. Uh, 
we will be installing Laravel Sail later on. And thank you for watching. So once you're done installing your Docker, you can now eject the Docker icon from your desktop.